What is going on everybody, 7FCO here, and today we are playing some Players Unknown Battlegrounds Mobile on my iPhone 10. However, we're playing the Chinese version, which has Sanok, uh, which is the new map that's actually going to be coming to the global version. I'm going to be playing in first person today. Uh, I've played a few matches on here. I really like it. Uh, this is my first time actually recording it. I've been playing PUBG for a while, the main game. Uh, and I've downloaded the two Chinese versions just so I can play some of the updates a bit early. Um, it's kind of hard at first to get used to, obviously, playing in Chinese with everything being a completely different language. But everything is mostly where you expect it to be and it isn't too bad. Now, unfortunately for this video, I can't do any sort of face cam. Um, I'm going to try in the future to do a face cam and a hand cam so you can see... Me playing as well and I do apologize that the video is in a very weird aspect ratio um, I believe it's 18 by 9 I can't uh, really remember but it's because I'm playing on an iPhone 10 the screen is a bit uh, wider uh, stretched out to the sides uh, just to give a more cinematic experience uh, cut around the notch Obviously, you can't see it in the video, but um, I enjoy playing on the iPhone 10. It's a good experience. Now, here, I actually get on this game a better ping than the regular PUBG Mobile. Here, I get an 80 millisecond ping. And on the regular PUBG Mobile, I get anywhere between 140 to up to 300, sometimes even 800 ping. It's pretty bad, and I have to be playing on my mobile data because my Wi-Fi... Uh, Currently, my room where I'm recording this does not actually uh, reach like very well. Like the connection's pretty weak in my room. Um, but yeah, here we go. So this is the map here. Let's open it up. I'm flying over here. I'm going to going to go and land at I believe this is Paradise Resort, unless they changed the name in the full version. I do have PUBG on my PC and on my Xbox. I play a bit on my Xbox. Uh, I played mostly on my PC, but the PC version kind of... I kind of grew out of the PC version. Um, I don't know. The inconsistency of it isn't very fun. There's also not much uh, in terms of extra stuff uh, other than just get in the game and then hop out again. They did recently do the Sanok Pass, which is kind of like a Fortnite Battle Pass sort of thing. Uh, which PUBG Mobile has the Royale Pass, which I actually really enjoy. It's going to be ending soon, but if only the regular PC version of PUBG could do something similar, then maybe I would get back into it. But uh, there's also a lot of sweaty people on there, a lot of people that know what they're doing. Some people that are really good at the game. So if you're kind of new to PUBG, you're going to get destroyed. And it's going to be kind of hard to learn, especially if you're hot dropping. Because a lot of these people just know how to destroy you. Alright, so here we are. We've landed. Hopefully, uh, we don't die straight away. Um, is there any gun? Here we go, Vector. Let me get the rest of this stuff here. It's also hard to see what mode I'm on. Got UMP here. Anything else here? Oof. QBZ, I'll take that. Four times. Um, let's see if I can get a... Get a good gun to use my four times scope on. Alright, swap this out. Pick up all this, grab that M4. Hopefully let's put that... Four times on the M4. Nice, nice, nice. Let's see, we've got a level three vest here. Some painkillers. A lot more ammo. More ammo. This place is just, has loot everywhere. Oh, someone right here. I haven't seen him. Ooh, hoo, hoo. just got him. I didn't want to use my gun with a four times. Doesn't have anything I want. Let's grab this. Auto attaches it. Let's grab some more painkillers. 
Uh, the weird thing about this version is that the, as you can see here, it's actually Monster instead of just in, like a regular energy drink. Uh, it's actually branded after Monster, which uh, they must have uh, permission to do that because I'm not sure how they'd do that without permission. Um, is Monster a Chinese company? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, shots coming from the left. I'm going to head into this building. Hopefully I can find myself a backpack. I don't think I have one. Can't really pick anything else up. Got a bit of ammo, I guess. Another level 3 backpack. You know what? I'm going to go join this fight because... Ooh, my health's a bit low. Try around 80% there. Let's see if we can find where these people were at. Try to take him out, or whoever's left. Uh, that's worth it. I could really. Hmm. I can drop some of that. Pick that up. Don't need any more ammo. I got plenty of it. This person right there. Got him. There's someone else there. Swap to M4. Got him. Easy kills. Alright. I'm hoping we can get a winner winner chicken dinner in this game. But if not, there's always next time. Um, Chinese players usually are known for being pretty good, especially with mobile gaming. It's not really that big where I am here in Australia backpack here. Only level one, but it'll do for now. Pick up another, I think that's an extended mag. I like finding as many heals as I can, even though I don't exactly need it. Level two backpack, there we go. Don't really need more ammo, but the more the merrier, I guess. Level 3 backpack, sweet. Plenty of room for more ammo. Alright. Here we got a mini. Um, oh, there's someone around here. I can hear them. Oh, just turned on them. My aim was a little off there, but let's just get in here so we can heal real quick. Um, well, we only need one bandage. Take a painkiller. Actually, are my painkillers in this drop? Side drop menu, whatever? Oh, yeah, they are. I will right, we'll take a painkiller. Take an energy drink. Should be good to go. Get our health up back up to 100. Nothing in here. S12K. Do not want that. Oh, angled fall grip. We'll take that and put that on our QBZ. QBZ, honestly, one of my favorite weapons. It's a laser beam. Uh, especially with that new ver vertical foregrip, pretty sure this shit will destroy. But, uh, let's see. Something I've noticed with this version is in the later game, it tends to start to lag a bit. And sometimes it can even be very dramatic and I can... Ooh, hold up. Hold that thought real quick. Let me just... Had some... Where was the other person? Did they die? Are they up here? Wait, where's the... I hear them. I hear them somewhere. Well, not anymore. Hmm. In here. Oh boy. My aim was not my sharpest just then, but we'll take it. We'll take it. Uh, I'm not sure what the point of these are. Oh, wait. Swap these out. Chuck these out. 
Sweet. I'm pretty sure these are extended quick draw mags, so best of both world worlds, uh, I should say. Alright, I'm pretty sure this area is clear. Not sure how many more people will be here. But let's just make sure, just in case. A couple texture glitches here and there. It's alright, no worries. The energy drink. Keep thinking they're candles, they're so tall. They look like the, uh, what is it? Miramar. Miramar candles. Jesus candles. Shit. Didn't mean to shoot there. Yeah, when I start moving towards more of the open areas, it kind of gets a little more laggy, which I didn't really expect. You'd think it would be the, oh, well, I guess it makes sense. Swap to my M4 here so I can, uh, target people from afar so I've noticed that the gun sounds seem a little different is that someone there that I don't know why that looked like someone to me but the gun sounds seem a little bit different I'm not really exactly sure why but we'll roll with it Nothing else in here. All I know is that there's a shit ton of 5.56 ammo, which normally there isn't in other maps. Um, but yeah, the map's a lot smaller, so there happens to be a lot more action. So we've got six people down. 25 to go. Well, more than six people down, but six people killed in my case. I think that's an airdrop just there. Can't seem to find any vehicles, but you don't necessarily need vehicles on a map this small. You can kind of traverse it on foot and uh, you get where you need to go pretty quick. Outrunning the storm, it's pretty easy. Don't exactly need to worry about the storm coming in unless you're way out and it's right up your ass, but you should be able to outrun it. Is that a boat right there? Yes, it is. See, now the game kind of starts to dip below 30. Um, normally, it's a stable 60 at the beginning. But, yeah. Um, so, I kind of want to do this on my channel. I know I have not been posting at all, and not many people are frequent viewers or anything like that. It's kind of just like post for fun, really. Um, but... COD's kind of been dead to me for a while. I've been playing more Battle Royale type games like Fortnite. Um, and I might do some Fortnite videos like just, you know, gameplay of fucking on the Switch or whatever. I mostly play on the Nintendo Switch. I have a PlayStation 4, an Xbox One, and a PC. Um, and I kind of switch between my Switch, my PC, and my Xbox quite a bit since they all share the same account. I used to play on PS4 primarily, but then the Switch version came out and I wanted to have that portability at my, uh, at my need, or however you say it. What did I, ADS just then? Um, yeah, so the portability of the Switch is really great. Me and my cousin, sometimes we just, wherever we're going to like a family event or something, both bring our Switches and we just play duos on Fortnite, wherever we are, it's... It's good. It's really good. It's better than being limited to just like one console and that's it. Um, and with PUBG, PUBG is also pretty fun, but it's a bit harder to learn. Uh, I'm more used to Fortnite, except PUBG on mobile is pretty fun. PUBG on PC is kind of difficult. And PUBG on Xbox, uh, I enjoy as well. Just wish it didn't have as many of the uh, performance issues as it does. Is that a QR code on my... I think that's a QR code on my scope. No worries. All right, well, we haven't seen anyone. It's been kind of slow, slow mid-game. How's the circle doing? We're in, what, it's the third circle. 18 people left, all right. So the games go quicker. 
than regularly, obviously. Since we are on... Oh! That caught me way off guard, and I just sprayed the shit out of that. That was probably not the greatest... Greatest kill. Got him. That person's already dead, I'm pretty sure. Yep. So now we're getting some action. Swap back to my QBZ over here. Let's see what this guy's got. Pan, nice. Uh, better level 3 armor. My one must be uh must have been dinged up a bit. Nothing up here. Swap back to my M4. Hmm. Can't seem to find anyone. Quickly boost. Get myself back up to 100. Alright. So, circle's closing in. Um, hmm. I don't know if we should stay here or if we should move. Maybe head towards that town there. I'm not 100% on the names. Uh, I have played on uh, Sanok on PC. I played when it was in the public servers, public test servers, whatever. Um, and I've played the full the full map now. Just can't exactly remember all the all the names. I don't really have the map. Memorized. I mostly just drop at the Paradise Hotel, whatever it's called. I think they changed the name of it, but I'm not 100% sure. Um, so we're just going to continue in this direction here. 11 people left, including myself, so 10 other enemies. Uh, is that a functioning vehicle? Looks like it. Um... So now we're pretty enclosed, the fourth ring, I'm sure. There's a lot of things popping in in the distance, and I think that it's uh, an enemy. So this is the Timmy version of the Chinese PUBG. There's two versions. There's this version, and then I'm not sure what the other version is. I think it's just the regular... Tencent version. Could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. But I have both versions. Um, the only difference that I can make, like there's a there's a couple differences in the like the UI and the menus and things like that. All right, two down. <laughs> That also caught me off guard, damn. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of UI changes, the kind of, the heads up display looks a little different. Uh, and also you can't access Sanok straight away, you gotta level up a bit. Um, and this is like, you can't play first person until you hit a certain level. This also has first person and third person changing, like you can change uh, perspective during regular third person matches, just like in the PC version. people here damn look at everything just popping in that's a uh, one of the problems with that Timmy version where is this person oh my 
Thank God it was reloading. I would have been dead right there. I don't know how I survived that. I swear this QBZ comes in clutch close range. Or versatile weapon. Alright. Well, we got 12 kills. We're in the final six. We're doing pretty good. Oof. He got one shot on. Let's boost up. Oh, thank you. Oof, all the boosts. I love stacking up the boosts. They can help so much. Take another painkiller. Saving up those boosts for the end game is the best. Right, well, it's an airdrop there. There's no point going for. Out of the circle. Um, should I? May as well, huh? All right. We're running that two times scope now. Should probably stay inside so I don't get shot out in the open. Oh, just as I say that. The wall blocked some of my shots, but doesn't matter, still got him. Fourteenth player down, moving into the circle. Bolting in. Alright, should we rock the four times? I wanna try get a long range. Four times kill. There's two other people left, and I wonder where they could be. Oh! Just as I say that. Goodbye. One other person. It's a one, last 1v1. Oh, where's that from? Hey, there we go. And... First, winner, winner, chicken dinner, Sanok. Take a little screenshot there. And 16 kills. I'm happy with that. 90 rating. 5 out of 5 stars. You know what? I'm happy with that. That was a good match. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the first look at Sanok. Um... I'm going to be playing some more PUBG on the regular PUBG and maybe a bit more Sanok. Um, we'll see in the future. Thanks, guys, for watching. Peace out.